Hey folks, this is the main prepper. I'm going to show you a trick what to do if somebody is following or tracking you. Usually if somebody is tracking, they're very good at finding sign. That means you're scarring or you're displacing. We will talk about those terms in later videos, but in either event, you know you're being followed and they're able to track you fairly well. There's a point though where even a very good tracker is not going to be able to find your sign. And that's going to be where if you get into a stream bed or, more commonly, you get onto a hard surface road, a road where you can't leave any sort of imprint. You can barely leave any sort of a sign unless your feet are just covered in mud or you're dripping blood or you're leaving breadcrumbs on the ground. I don't think you want to do any of that deliberately, but uh, that's probably the only way that somebody's going to find you if you can find a hard surface road. Now here, we'll use black for our people and red will be the trackers. What you don't want to do is come straight to the road and then turn because then they'll have to make a decision and they may split their forces and go either way. What we want to do is make them think that you went in a certain direction and this is so easy and some of you are already probably there. You're going to approach the road and when you see the road what you want to do is you want to start angling this way. All right. And when you get on the road, eventually, you're going to not leave any more tracks or sign. There's not going to be any more mud on your feet or anything else. And once you get going in this direction and you know that everybody is up on the road, this is what's important if you have a bigger group of people. Because if you start turning around and going back, well, Joe Snuffy, in the end, he's just going to go this way. So don't do that. Make sure that everybody understands to get up on the road and clean their feet and then we're going to contra our direction. We're going to head back this way. Okay? Now here's what the bad guys are going to do if they're following you. They're going to follow in your tracks. They're going to be tracking you. And when they come to the road, they're going to say, obviously, these people went that way. And nine times out of ten, they're going to commit their forces and they're going to go this way for a good distance until they finally figure out it may be quite a while before they figure out that you're not there anymore. And so this is kind of a cat and mouse type situation, but what you want to do is make sure that you get all of your feet clean when they're up on the road. You stomp your feet and everything, but you don't want to make it so obvious that you're doing this, but you do want to have that little curve that makes it look like we're going this way here. The best thing to do when you're being tracked is to try to put out the illusion in the minds of the person that's tracking you that you're not very good and then suddenly you get good and you disappear. That's a very, very easy thing to affect because you can leave some obvious signs. I mean, you don't have to actually draw an arrow in the ground, but if you occasionally kick a rock over, break a limb, or just sit down on the ground and leave a butt imprint with your rucksack, they're going to track you pretty good. All right, folks, this has been a real quick tip on how to disappear using a hardball road. When we come back, I'm going to show you another way to do this, and this time we're going to use a stream bed. And this is probably one of the most common tricks out there, especially if they have tracker dogs. But tracker dogs will not be able to pick up your scent if you're walking on a hardball road. I'm telling you because there's just too many things uh, confusing and obliterating the scent up there, including uh, diesel fuel and everything else that's been... Uh, 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 blowing out of exhaust pipes on the ground, rubber, who, know, who knows. So uh, unless again you're bleeding or you're leaving breadcrumbs on the ground, chances are pretty good a hardball road is going to be your best bet for losing somebody that's tracking you. Keep in mind if they're real close and this hard surface road is up on a hilltop and there's no cover around, uh, when you do this you're going to have to move pretty quick. So what we used to do was we'd go down, we'd get on the road and as soon as we got our feet clean we'd turn around and double time back the other way and hope uh, that the guys tracking us, usually using dogs, uh, would be following this way and eventually they lose track. Now if they're pretty smart, they won't go too far. They'll go an hour or so and if they don't find any sign, uh, they're going to say, you know what, let's go back the other way. Or they'll split their forces if they have a lot of people, but if it's a small element and they're dogging you, this way uh, you can break off and disappear. Okay folks, when we come back, we'll talk about streams.